There's nothing here. This weird ocean we're surrounded by just stretches out everywhere. Is this really where the Helganquil come from? I don't sense even a trace of astral energy. This world is... dead. Then this must be the Hollowing. You mean to tell me this whole world? The entire ocean is... that stuff? And it's covering everything. The entire planet. This is what the Great Spirit does. After it depleted this planet of every last speck of astral energy, it went after Dana. So arresting, this world of doom. Back in its day, Rena was probably just as vibrant as Dana is. But after being robbed of its astral energy for so long, those days are gone and past. This is all that will remain. So the Great Spirit took everything. It stole energy not just from living beings, but the land, the sea, everything. And it bound the Helganquil in servitude, until their whole world was nothing but this. And by the looks of it, that's how it remains to this day. A world of death and emptiness. With nothing left here to consume, the Great Spirit turned its sights on Dana, looking for another host. You're saying if we don't stop it, this is what Dana's going to look like? We can be sure that even these few remaining remnants of Ren and life will not be spared in the end. If the oblivion and darkness both Xion and Naori saw comes to pass, Nothing will survive. It looks like we can climb down from there. Let's take a look. So this is Rena. This is where everything began, yet it's a dead world? I won't let Dana suffer the same fate, ever. A hollowed ocean as far as the eye can see. What do you think would happen if we fell in? What do you mean, what would happen? You'd drown. Wouldn't you? Come to think of it, I don't believe I've heard of someone ever trying. Perhaps you'd like the glory of being the first? Nah, I'll pass. This is essentially a world-sized Renan graveyard. Are you proposing to disturb the dead slumber just to satisfy your curiosity, Law? No, because I said I passed! Taking an interest is understandable, but let's not forget where we are. This place deserves our respect. Looks like we're not going to be hearing the end of this one for a while. You'd think I was already snorkeling in it or something. So the idea is to seal the Great Spirit inside the Renis Alma using the Sovereign and Maiden's power. But just how do we do that exactly? I'm guessing it won't be as easy as holding a spirit-channeling ceremony at our leisure. I already had wielded astral energy once three centuries ago. As for suppressing her thorns, Xion's had a lifetime's experience. 
The problem isn't just our enemy's strength. It's that it's sentient, too. And you can bet anything you like, it's not going to just sit back and let us destroy it. In other words, we need to find some way to weaken it in advance. The Great Spirit, that is. Back when Xion's thorns flew out of control, we were able to deal with them directly. If this is their host, they should be even more corporeal here. If that's the case, it should make them easier to attack at least. And if we can manage to divert enough energy away from the spirit's core, even temporarily... We might just be able to weaken it enough to steal the Renis Alma, which we can then use to seal it away forever. It won't be easy, but it's our only shot. Time to buckle up! Question for you. Let's say, knock on wood, everything turns out for the best. What'll the world be like? Is that what you're asking? Yeah, I mean, at the end of this, do you really think everything will be that different? A lot will have to change, that's for sure. The world will have to adjust to so much. My only worry is if those changes turn out to be merely skin deep. What do you mean? It's well and good putting an end to Ren and Rule. But if it just turns the tables, it's all for naught. That's true. Just as bad if the Danans start oppressing their own. Renans, Danans, astral art users, mages. The world is full of labels used to divide and separate people. If only we could see differences like that for what they are. No different to someone having a musical talent or being good with their hands. Not differences so much as characteristics. It will take someone in power to set an example. But with time, people will follow. And then, perhaps one day... There will no longer be any need for the example. It will have become second nature. That's where we come in. We can set the example. Imagine it. A world where magic and astral arts are used to help people. Where that's the norm rather than the exception. Yeah, you're right, Rinwell. Why wait for somebody else? We can show them ourselves. Something. Is this about dinner last night? I didn't realize those ingredients were off. What? No, I mean... Wait, you fed us rotten food? Rinwell, the point. Hmm? Uh, oh, yeah, right. So I was thinking about those armored soldiers we've seen. There are regular Renans inside them, right? Yeah, they're designed to make whoever's wearing them stronger. At least, I think that's the idea. Right. So it kind of begs the question, then. Why are they made so huge? I don't know. Makes them more intimidating, I guess. Or maybe all that tech wizardry inside takes up a lot of space. You don't think it's weird how the armored soldiers are the exact same height as the Hell Ganquil? Can't say I'd ever noticed it till now. And? Connect the dots, Law! Okay, let me get this straight. You think the armored suits might have originally been designed to allow Renans to work alongside the Helganquil? Huh. But if that's true, what would that mean? It would mean... just that, I guess. But still, don't you think it's kind of interesting? Not... hugely? Hey, Kisara, while I've got you, what's on tonight's menu? Because I was thinking, maybe meat? Get him, Hoodle. Oh, ooh, what did I do? Oh, now you want to listen. Keep pecking, Hoodle. Uh, ow, ow, ow! Seriously, what the hell? You know, guys, when you think about it, we've taken out a lot of Zoogles. Like, a whole lot. You can say that again. If one thing's for certain in this world, it's that wherever we go, we'll always end up bumping into them. Isn't it weird that they're still so plentiful? You don't think the Renans have, like, a ranch where they breed them, do you? Certainly in all of my years, I've never heard of them constructing such a massive facility on Dana, let alone up in Lenigus. The only thing I can think of, then, is that the Feral Ones must be reproducing on their own. 
There's also no organized effort on our part to hunt them down, so it's difficult to fully exterminate them. Exterminate them? Whoa, don't you think that's maybe a little harsh? What do you mean? Zoogles originally used to be living creatures native to Dana and Rena, right? Being genetically modified isn't their fault. You're right. Zoogles were only created because of us Renans. We altered the original creatures to suit our own ends. First people made Zoogles, and then we let them go. And now we're trying to kill them because they're a threat. They really have only seen the very worst, huh? I hope we find a way to be able to live side by side with them one day. It's a nice thought, but they attack towns and cities. What else are we supposed to do? Aside from the strays that have gone wild, it's worth remembering that Renans are able to keep them somewhat under control. If we had distinct territories that didn't overlap, that might reduce the danger they pose. Well, I guess when you look at it that way, maybe people and Zoogles aren't so different after all. I wonder what Hilganquil civilization was like at its zenith. I can imagine that'd be something you'd take an interest in. There's no question it must have been advanced, like none either world has ever seen. We could surely stand to learn a thing or two from such a people. I get that you're itching to delve into its history, but we've got bigger fish to fry right now. Put a pin in it, and you can do all the research you want when you retire. I can think of worse things than a retirement dedicated to research. As for whether Rena is amenable to an aging specimen... It's a little early to be giving it serious thought just yet. A man can dream, though. A man can dream. Oh, we didn't say there's anything wrong with dreaming. In your case, Dohalim, dreams have a habit of spiraling into something else. You'll need to stay with us for now, though. You're too helpful to let retire. Why do I feel this is less of a compliment and more of an ultimatum? Just a friendly suggestion. Looks like we've warped into that pit of astral energy. Ganquil. Guess they don't need their Red Woman disguises anymore. Wait, can you understand us? It's no use. We're not going to get through to them. So they really are being controlled. In that case, we've got no choice. I knew there was something off here? They're not pulling punches. We have no choice but to beat them at their own game. Double team and kill! I tell you what, I'm freaking done! Eat this! Don't get in my way! Get forward! Here it goes! Now you got company! Hurricane! Can't get out of this! I'm ready! Dragon Sword! I'll bring you down! I'll take it from here! Let's see how you handle this! Deus War! I'm going to be 
to use all the power of your to accomplish this. Your arms are really incredible. Not much longer to go. Come on. I promise I'll always be here. Your actual arms are truly incredible. Holy! Blow them away! In a vine? Now! You're all dead! Look sharp! Lightning Tiger Blade! Alfin. I can't forgive them for what they've done, but I hate killing them. They don't even know why they're fighting. How does that even make them any different from the Danon slaves? Perhaps. However, if we don't make a choice, the guilt of not doing anything will be that much worse. Yeah, I know. I hate for it to be like this. But if it happens again, you won't find me hesitating to act. I wonder if we're going to get attacked again. If we lose heart now, this whole mission is over. We have to stay the course. I thought there'd be more dirt and rocks and stuff underneath the hollowed ocean, but it's all artificial. I would imagine they're remnants left behind by the Helganquil, seeing as there's little actual land remaining. It's incredible. Do you think it stretches all the way down to the center of the planet? Hey, these guys built Lenigus, remember? They probably did this in a weekend. If they had the power to create things like this, did they really only use those immense capabilities to serve the Great Spirit? Or rather, was that the only use the Great Spirit let them use their capabilities for? We haven't seen anyone here except Helganquil. Looks like this place really is their home planet. The true citizens of Rena. What a shame that they have become nothing more than puppets to the Great Spirit. To think of the promise their accomplishments once held. They had the potential to be great indeed. Do you think we could have got along with them? You know, if we had met under different circumstances. Like... Like all of us, you mean? I suppose it's difficult to say for sure. We don't even know if they would see us as being on an equal level with them or not. I think we may have had the chance once, before the Renan Great Spirit came along and... changed everything. You and Alfin both share an optimism. A strong willingness to believe in hope. <laughs> Do you think that's foolish? On the contrary, I should like to take a leaf from your book myself. In Tragedy's Aftermath, Hope is all we have. Just look at the size of that thing. The Helganquil's technology certainly is impressive. And they don't seem to do things by halves, either. In the past 300 years, no, oh, even before that, just how many people, Renan or Danon, do you think have ever seen this? Regarding the past three centuries, at least, I'd say there's a good chance that we're the first. Also, while I get that it's impressive and all, I'm just amazed you're still standing around gawping at it at a time like this. Sometimes I wonder about your priorities. I can understand where he's coming from. More to the point, does anyone know where it leads? What do you mean, where it leads? To the center of the planet, of course. And that doesn't strike you as sounding just a little bit, oh, I don't know, far? There has to be a quicker way to get there, right? Yeah. With all this technology at their fingertips, it seems pretty unlikely that they'd make that kind of journey on foot. There must be some kind of device somewhere. Let's see if we can figure out how to use it. Borrow one of their contraptions? You're either brave or out of your mind. If it works for them, there's no reason it wouldn't for us. Why make things harder for ourselves? 
You know what he's like, Law. Once he gets an idea in his head, there's no talking him out of it. Is this a dead end? It appears this whole room functions as an elevator. That apparatus there is likely what's used to control it. What the? Where did they go? More action! Concentrate! What a relief! Watch this! I can any steel! Fall free! What can they just sit still? See up! Can you take care of them? No sooner said than done! Now! Air throw see what happened there as you cross me! Inferno punch! Destroy lightspear! Fire! Oh, Get toasty! Burn strike! Right, next one! Already on! That'll bring you down! Not much longer to go! Enemies are coming! One final push! Then we'll stick together, Alpha! Glacial Spear! Here's the evil! Stand Keep calm and take them down! Where you going? Fire. You don't have firearms here on Ghana. I can show you mine if you like. That would be really awesome, Sean. Rising Lightning! Hammer! 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 Dragon Swarm! I'm on it! Here's Swarm! Yeah, nothing gets game. by me! Glimmer Dragon! Can't get out of this! Do it! Law! Demons descend! Flashing Fang! Leaving Flame! Reload! Take it! Fist on! Inferno Punch! Air Throw Corruption! A whirling struggle! Go again! I'll crush you! <laughs> Lightning Reflexes! Tenebrous Claw! <laughs> Rising white Rising Easter! Shattering the pieces! Attack time! Here I come! Can't be Dragon Swarm! Do it! Don't leave! Hey! Throw them away! None shall escape my judgment! Burn it hell! May a thousand gales carry it away! I'm going to need to use all the power of my life! Don't kill that girl! Damn it, Moore! Resurrection! No further! You're on! Dragon Swarm! Crush! 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 <laughs> Ignite! By the power of the hurricane! Burn! Where are you going? Here it goes! Cut more! Annihilation! Right now! Not on my watch! Blow away! A world of This one's mine! Demons of heaven! Demons of heaven! Demons descend! Flashing fang! Now! More! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! There you oh, go, Alvin! It's time to end the battle! with me! I'm right beside you! I'm ready! Now you see what I can do! Searing Crack your face! Crack your face! Double demon face! Demon face! I'm out of here! I'll crush you! <laughs> Lightning reflexes! Tenebrous claw! With this, I can become even stronger! Even in such a harsh environment as this, there are still creatures here? You think they're native to Rena? Or could... They be Zoogles somehow. Whatever they are, they're dangerous. Watch yourselves around them. You think that pit stretches all the way... I'm like no fate to them! Denied! Rifle! Hurricane thrust! This 
one. Oh, oh, uh, these things really get on my nerves. No, no. it's in the sky. This ends now. You consider yourself finished. There you go, Elfin. It's time to end this. What I can do? I'm right beside you. Where are you going? Franklin, the wind. Uh, uh, the power of the Do it. Winds of astral energy. Say no more. Sidus, take this. Together, that wasn't even a problem. Got to break through! I can carve through armor! Can't get out of this! Spirit Flame! Reload! These ones can run rings around us! Now come one, come on! Not today! Here goes. If it's in the sky, it's the mine! Yeah. Double yeah. Demon 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 Demon. Demon. Too fast! Stand back! I'll Here's trip it up! Vacuum blade! Demon Fang! Now! It's time. This ends now! Consider yourself finished! There you go, Alvin! It's time to end this battle! I'm right beside you! Burn it now! In the you shouldn't have messed with me! Here I come! Last this is for you, Dad. Take this. this Armor won't save me. Now I'm in the groove. Mirage. Take Shut where you are. Labor shield. This is for me. A banana. A blazing thrust. I lost. Wish they were all that easy. some equipment.
Let me take a look at it. I expect you'll be in high demand if that's the case. These structures don't look like anything built by the Renans. Or even what we saw in the Forbidden Zone. Perhaps this is the true architectural style of the Helganquo. Or perhaps the opposite, given their... ...situation. You mean like how some places favor building... stuff with stone while others rely on wood? That's an interesting way of looking at it. Hi, you the healing arm! In a bomb like bait to them! The freezing storm! Demon Spread! Insects to stay on the ground! I'm really a blind freak! Seal, can you take care of them? No sooner said than done! Now! The floor will bring you down. Yours to be let free. Blast! You picked the wrong fight. Do it! Do it! Get toasty! Burn strike! Right, next one. I can carve through. Already on it. I don't know what I'd do without you. Perhaps now is the time. I really don't. Do you require a hand? Yukara, I'll stop your movement, and I'll stop your life. Glacial Spear! Here's the evil! Freeze it! Arrow Fall! Steering Flame! You're mine! In a vine! Now! Throw it away! Now I'm real mad! Seems about right to me. It'll be 
to breathe. Get in, get out. Demon Prince! Prepare to be sealed! Move up for action! It can hide itself? For me? Watch it! Anything in my eyes all weapon material when I see it. Those thorns. I'm not letting them get in our way. We got some good equipment. I can't... Say its appearance is too much. I can feel my precision improving. This will be a delicious piece of cake. Oh, no of further. Vanish with all the rivers. Sorry, I'm on a roll. Oh, now I'm you real mad. It's a thing here. Sorry, let me go. Oh, now you're talking. I'll crush you. Lightning reflexes! Tenebrous claw! First strike! Here, let me help! Good uh, lord! Not today! Armor won't save you! Deny! Radiant Storm! Come on! Hold on to your eyes! Here I come! Evil. Sword Rain Alpha! Full Lord! Eternal Devastation! Hear me! Please now! Let me roll! 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 Do you require a This one's for you, Dad. Take this. Here I come. Huh? Burn. Here I go. Reload. Armor won't save you, Castle. First strike. Move it from the left. Amazing. Incineration wave. I never miss. Rising Rider. Vintage Predator. This is bad. Yes, now I'm real mad. It's idle. No further. Now! 
Trigger! Astral energy! Say no more! Remember to tell me if you need healing. I expect you'll be in high demand if that's the case. some decent equipment anything that makes battles easier is okay by me energy was incredible. I gave it everything I had. Looks Let like trouble with my capital heart can be. Together, we've got this! Now it's my loot. So much for sitting this fight out. No, 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 no. Nope, that'd be silly. Far enough! Hold on Thanks. to your arc. Here strike. I come! Now! Astral energy! Full throttle! A flawless victory. Now I'm in the group! Naturally! Tordling out! Let's do it! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! Vanquish darkness! Now I'm in the group! My fists are crushing it out there! What's with that shining foe over there? Oh, 
man. I hope I... Now! Astral energy! 
Say no more. Easy peasy. Ha hoodle. Nice move there. I know, right? Bet you couldn't do it. So it's a grab here, thrust the left leg, then use the right arm to leverage over. Stop memorizing my move! Oh, 
Here I come! Ignite! I'll take you all on! Annihilate your dreams! Armor won't save you! Fall and it'll bring you down! Oh. It can hide it, though? Amazing! Where's it going? Look sharp! Lightning Tiger Blade! See that? That training's paying off! On Thunder Field! You see what happened there is you crossed me. Shouldn't have done that. Turn on Sleep now. Burning strike! Let's get you up. Now I'll crush you! Lightning reflexes! Tenebrous claw! Quit pushing yourself and get behind us! Oh, I'll be right ready in no time! There you go! Do it! Rima! Astral energy! Say no more! Don't get complacent. It's no ordinary enemy, I see. I have a bad feeling about this. Yeah. Come and face me! Lightning Force! Healing circle! Strike! Fall into thy Force Force Force. 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 Uh, These Force. things really get on my nerves. Force. Will this help? Anything in order to go? Pesky airborne scoundrels. Force. Sounds like a job for your truly. I can truly. carve through Force. armor. Force. Take this! Force. Why'd you heal Is that you dying? Oh, right. Right. If it's in the sky, get toasty! Bird strike! Right, next one! Already on! Burn in hell! Dance in the wind! What is this? Will this help? Death to Magic is healing circle! I really am not in the cool! without you. What do you think this place was for? Ah! 
What the hell? Are they asleep? No. They appear to be well preserved. However, they are all... dead. Dead? So this is... a mass grave? Looks that way. However, none of them appear to be Helganquil. Bear in mind that Renans were originally Danans, who were remade and sent to live on Lenigus. Knowing that, they would have needed a place to perform the procedure somewhere. And that place is here, I assume. So what you're saying is that all of these are Danon, or rather, Renan bodies? Most likely, yes. It must have been abandoned for one reason or another. There are so many of them. They were all taken away, but never given the chance to wake. Thing. Something we have to fight if we want to get across, it seems. Be careful! It's huge! What is with all the huge lumbering beasts lately? It's no ordinary zoo. That much is damn sure. Watch yourselves. All bets are off when it comes to this thing. down somehow to hit it. In that case, let's start with the one in the middle. Reload! Do you require a hand? Harry is gone! I'll smash you! I Tornado! In a bind? Slash the shot! He's in! He's in! Enough today! Dance in the wind! Start up! Arrow slaughter! Let the mark him in the dark! Touch more! Holy glimmer! Touch the dark! Shouldn't have messed with me! Rising Falcon! This thing is medically approved! Talent Storm! Be still! Use a healing arc! Uh, There's something in here! Look here! You just say the word and I'm there! In a vine? I can't believe it's come to this! Ignite! Savage Storm! Talent Storm! Watch this! It's all right there! Here, let me Oh, now you it! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! Here, let me help! Flaming thrust! Light after lightning and Take this! Super. I'll smash you! Dance Last the I owe you one. Here. Blazing Blazing steel. Steel. Now I can let loose. Inferno Pine! Now Burn! Blazing Thrust! Holy Lord! Blazing Thrust! Blazing Thrust! Blazing Thrust! Blazing Thrust! Blazing Thrust! Now we beat the crap out. Allow me to stay on your good side. Breeze Lancer! It looks like you got 
You picked the wrong one! Last one! Commander of Heaven! Phoenix Sokka! The hell was that thing? Probably something that was made here and somehow managed to survive, even after all this time. Not that there's any way of knowing now. <sighs> What's wrong? Oh, I just suddenly found myself contemplating what might have happened to the sovereigns that were meant to emerge from the crown contests. What do you mean? You see, the winners of the past crown contests were all strong astral arts practitioners. Furthermore, that enemy we just fought appeared to be composed of several human bodies. It was certainly nothing one would find in nature. You're saying those were the remains of the winners? That they forgot who they once were? I'm merely saying it's a possibility. That's... absolutely gruesome. How long had the Helganquil been at this? It was Rena's great spirit that made them do all of this. Anything to get its astral energy. <sighs> we're not gonna jump down, right? I certainly hope not. After hearing Dohalim's suggestion, I'm honestly not sure what to say. I assure you all, I was merely stating the possibility. So, looks like the Helganquil have been engineering Zoogles too. Why doesn't that surprise me at this point? The creatures we've been encountering here have been a little different to what we're used to fighting, but I'm pretty sure they're Zoogles too. Do you think they were engineered using creatures native to the area? Indeed. However, based on the current circumstances, I would guess these Zoogles are all that's left of the planet's fauna now. You mean... there might have been native owl species here once upon a time too? Back in that other room? Did the teleporter fail or something? Something feels off about it. Look! Everything's upside down! The furnishings are at least. No, you're right. The whole room's flipped on its head. So what was once down is now up, and vice versa. I suppose the teleporter reversed our orientation then. <laughs> 